Hey y'all, welcome back to Let's Play DK64. Last time we finished up everything we can do in Dungle Jungle Jacks for the time, and this time we are going to start level 2. Let's get no hesitation, let's get right into it. Well, but it looks like Armadillo was destroyed by DK. Something tells me this one, due to uh, reasons, wasn't supposed to be in this level. And you'll see what I mean later on. Much later on. <laughs> like, maybe like... 300 videos from now. It's not going to be 300 videos, I promise. Probably be much less than that. Well, there's our number one pad. Cool. So, I know last video, last world I kind of structured the level a bit weird. Well, not weird, but like, you know, in a much more normal manner. I can't guarantee that here. This is definitely going to be a much different uh, kind of level in terms of structure. I don't really gotta this is where things kind of stop being like you know so more open i guess well more open yeah not less open more open so first thing you want to do is head in here Want an extra melon? Hell yeah, I'll take an extra melon. A few extra melons, actually. Oh. Funny story was I actually got banned from Meverse because when I was playing this game, um, I went on Meverse and whenever we got to, uh, whenever we I got to <laughs> this part. I literally just went on Meverse and uh, typed in expand dong and got like, and got, well, I don't, I got my post removed. I wasn't banned, I don't think. I wish I was. That would have been hilarious. I have a friend, actually, um, Sleazy Weasel, um, who, who took great pride in seeing how many times he could be banned from Meverse. He got banned, I think. <laughs> I think he got banned, um, <laughs> 15 times I'm not sure it was oh my god um I don't know if any of you have ever seen this one post from Meverse I my least favorite character is Sonic because he's fast like my dad when he chases me with the belt um that was my friend Darren who posted that <laughs> or Sleazy Weasel and oh my god that is to this day one of my favorite things ever sadly he got tiny Kong too well there's our next character so first thing we need to do is jump on this, is ground pound this pad. Oh man, I really miss Maverse though. It was the most hilarious thing ever. God, I would kill for that service to come back. When it first came out, I thought it was like really dumb because I was like, oh god, I really hate like, you know, meme culture and all that shit. But then I like kind of, you know, had like a change of heart on meme culture suddenly and I'm like actually this is pretty good stuff I think you can also thank Darren though for like just how much he just loved the shit post on like fucking Jesus Christ sorry guys I hate straight lines <laughs> don't get enough time to really do it either so but there's like 15 bananas on that thing, which is nice. Which should definitely be enough to finish up the boss of Angry Aztec pretty quickly, I would imagine. I could like have like all these like, you know. Believe it or not, like, yeah, I think in like this one area in Jungle Jade we haven't accessed yet because we can't. Because we need Tiny Kong for it, and that's what we just saw. Um, I think there's actually like... 
a like area for like the pig duders and stuff there. Made it though. Okay, so to use your instrument, you go up C on like the N64 controller, whatever you customize your control scheme to be C on here. Like I would have kind of like the uh, whether it's D pad or uh, I don't know, you can do whatever you want. Pretty sure some people will do D pad, I'm pretty sure some people will do uh, I don't know, not that. Um, that's, I don't think that button's even pressable, for that matter. I'll say one thing, though, is this controller is a lot more comfortable than the N64 controller. Even if it does kind of give me some awkward input sometimes. I mean, I don't think this game was built around, um... It's probably why the GameCube games never actually appeared on the Virtual Console. Go up to Tiny and she'll say some stuff. Cool. Alright. So, next thing is next. I'm gonna... K... Oh, I could actually, as a kid, I had the hardest time unlocking Tiny Kong because I'm so horrible at, like, you know, precision platforming and 3D platformers. Now, luckily, I don't think this is going to be much of an issue. It's going to be an issue again, for sure. It's a 3D platformer that was made in the N64 era. And granted, while a lot of the first-party Nintendo titles in the N64 era tend to be really good or well-made... And stuff, and now that Tiny Kong's rescued, you're gonna see like purple balloons just show up everywhere. Well, that's my 12th golden banana. Alright. Well, let's continue the level. I just think it is the best idea to continue. I don't think there's anything else we can do here as Diddy Kong, so I'm just gonna off screen to the exit of the area. There you are. Right. Unless there's like some coins down here. Nope. Okay. All right. Hmm. All right, so outside the temple now. We're going to head, uh, I guess not there. We don't need to do that yet. Um, I will need Donkey Kong, actually, to remark one thing in a minute. There's some DK bananas up in these trees, but I'm not going to worry about that yet. I'll worry about Donkey Kong in a bit. I'm going to keep Diddy Kong out for now. I will need Donkey Kong for an upcoming area. Though I'm also going to need Diddy Kong for an upcoming area, which in turn... This will open up a very good entryway, but... Whatever. We're going to do it. So now we can head. So we're looking at in terms of time. I feel like I cut off like four minutes on there though. Well, okay. Um. That one's for Tiny Kong, but I'm gonna try to avoid that for now. Let's head over. Well, yep. See, precision platforming, best thing ever created for games like this. I swear it probably got a lot. It definitely got a lot better in like you know the. Uh, I need Diddy Kong right now. I'm gonna keep Diddy Kong out. So, um, head in here. And I can get probably Diddy Kong's most well known new, the Rocket Barrel Boost. Rocket Barrel Boost. This is probably a very familiar move to a lot of you, especially those of you who have played uh, DK64. I mean, Smash Brothers. Especially games after Brawl. Brawl and after, because... Well, it is Diddy Kong's Final Smash, so... Well, that's fine. I'm definitely... 
good at video games sometimes. Aren't there some? Nope. Looks like there's some purple bananas, but I'm not going to worry about that right now. Again, take it one step at a time. And there's some red coins, but I can't do that with Decon. That's actually for another time we don't get till way later. Well, not way later, but not soon. Well, okay, there's the number two. And there's the number three and the number four. Okay, jump into the rocket barrel. Right here. If you wanna head up here, heck yeah, I wanna head up here. Get five bananas. And I think I wanna head right up here as well. Yeah, there it is, cool. I wanna get this for sure. Yes, cool. Definitely something I want to do here. I need that. So let's go ahead, get into the rocket. Real quick though, no, don't switch to tiny. I just want to cover my health. You can jump into a barrel to recover health anytime. I think I have mentioned that. There's Spunky's armory. Um, Beauty of Funky's Armory is the four pad is just kind of really close to the other four pad. Uh, so you can head in there. Um, jump in the armory with the rocket booster. And I fell off because I am really good at video games sometimes. I really screwed that up. <laughs> Sorry. Remember, yeah, you can actually, you know, not do that. Can I actually hold the uh Got it, that's one. That's two that's not two. That's two. That's three. I think you need them like five. No, oh, it's four. Okay. Cool. Let's head in there then. Alright. Let's head over there. Yeah, that'll get us to yet another area for some of the colonies. I actually didn't discover this area until I was like nine years old. I let me tell you right now, the original DK64, whenever I was playing it on the N64, back when I was a kid, it took me like four years to beat the game. I never even 100 percent in it until I was like 16. Um, for reference, I'm going to be 25 next week. Well, I mean, probably by the time this video is uploaded. I think this is actually going to upload on my birthday. I don't want to... No, this one's going to upload two days after my birthday. So I'm 25 now when this is uploaded. So that was... Year, no, I was 50 when I beat this game for the first time, yeah? Let's see what's over here. Nothing's over here except... Oh, red coin. That's nice. Need that. I think everyone needs that. Sweet. But I never discovered these things until I was like... Nine years old or something. I don't remember how old I was. Never even beat the game until I was nine, for that matter. Because I didn't know to, like, get the coin from the DK arcade machine. Keep in mind, you know, kids don't use the internet much. Especially people who are nine years old. Now, we, like, do job and stuff like that. I'm not going in there yet. I'm going to head this way instead. So I can at least, like, you know, shoot some bananas and stuff. Because, yeah. And plus, like, the second you even take anything out of this area, you know, you kind of end up with, like, a problem. I'm going to grab that banana coin as well. Banana coin, sorry, guys. Don't like me to say banana. Got it. So there we go. Shoot the banana. Cool. 
you are looking at about uh, 30 minutes. I will estimate the video. I might just split this into two parts even. Nothing I'm against doing. I mean, I know my small videos up to this point have been less than like 20 minutes. I do not tend to go for videos longer than, for those of you who are probably tuning in for the first time, I don't try to go for videos longer than 30 minutes, though I try to keep it at 25 minute ratio. I think we're good for now. Timing, so I don't think we need to cut. Okay, that's good there. Um, next thing I can think of, I need to, uh, well, um, two things I can think of actually. Thing number one. Is, okay, don't get myself killed. There's Snide HQ. Um, let's see, I think there might be a banana over he here ish. Well, there's three bananas. Yeah, this one I need to get. Cool. I was thinking correctly. I was like, where, where are they? Uh, yeah, there they are. Cool. Same into these things. Slam into that. Slam into that. Cool. Okay, yeah, that's what I was thinking about. I thought they got a banana for that. Cool. So that means next thing is next is go up here. I know it's also like one of my worst enemies. Worst nightmares right there. Oh my god, I'm remembering something. Remembering one thing, yeah. Cool. There we go. And that's the banana medal for Diddy Kong on this level. Let's try this level as Diddy Kong to get Tiny Kong first, because he has the most things you can do at the beginning of the level. I think most of you probably caught on to that, though. There's another batch of bananas. And we need uh, one more. Yeah. Alright, let's head into the rocket boost. Cool. So, head into the rocket boost bear. Actually, one minute. One other thing real quick, though, is back at the beginning of the level, because I remember this challenge being a bit of a pain in the arse. I know, I remember the uh, Diddy's being on top of a temple. Diddy's uh, blueprint dude being on top of a temple. And I remember where it is now, actually. Um, and in fact, I knew where it is now because I, because I know it's on top of a temple. First things first, though, let's recover some health. You know, I probably should be looking at this my, my TV the whole time because, pff, long story short, I'm gonna get better control on this end anyway. And I am correct. I know. Yep, it's. I know. I remember now for sure. You know I was correct. Well, oh, and that's fun because I messed it up. Of course, you know, we gotta go up, up, up in the tree. Oh, that's wrong. There we go. Cool. Grabbed it. And then we're gonna go for the last, uh, let's go for the last Diddy Kong banana. <laughs> so we're going to the last area where you can get a Diddy Kong banana, which will be, believe it or not, same peanut dude, peanut duder. 
tell you one thing I know about these things. Is I absolutely do not like what we're about to do. These this is probably one of my least favorite challenges in the game. Number one though, let's uh, keep going kind of straight. But what sucks about the challenge though is well yeah, you know one mistake and you kind of you know. Luckily, there's only like two challenges like this in the game. You know, I'm gonna have to be saying that about a lot of things. Dude, you're taking a long ass time to start flying. I'm gonna go visit him at the jetpack barrel. Heck yeah. Though he's gonna take like two hours to get there because, you know, why not? Where is he? There he is, yeah. Kinda prefer when games actually, you know. Whoa, okay. Frick. Frick. Frick, get up! Diddy, oh my god. Okay, no. Yes. Thank you. At least you can try again. Up into the jetpack. Up into the jetpack. Okay, let's see what we got now. Okay, you want to fly into the rings. Precisely. 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 Okay, go down the ring. There we go. Yeah, now you kind of see a bunch of, uh, you know, random things on your websites, though. When you're a kid. So, yeah, God, this is one of the worst. I hate this one so much. Yeah, see, that's a problem. Let's off screen to the successful attempt. In the ring. Get in the ring. God damn, I hate this thing so much. Okay, I wish you could just fly straight. Shit. Get up. Tip number five. That's good. That's good. That's good. Good. That's good. That's good. Thank you. Ha <laughs> ha. All right. Sorry, I kind of had to focus on that. Cool. Well, that's all for Diddy Kong, I guess. <laughs> I think so. Wait, is it? Oh yeah, I haven't also gotten the banana at the top of this thing yet, have I? Have I? No, I haven't. Okay, well, I'll have to take care of that. Cool. Saxophone. Well, I don't have that yet. Uh, maybe we'll have that soon, though. Maybe. But 
I think that's about all I'm gonna do for this video. I will meet you guys back at like the main area where like we like with the cages and stuff in the next episode. As Donkey Kong. So next time on Let's Play DK64, we will take on Donkey Kong's portion of the level. See you guys then. <laughs>